Once the storm hit, all communication ceased. We were alone, fearful. My name is Christy Paulsell and we live in Mandeville, Louisiana. My daughter, PJ, is 29 years old now. Um, 10 years ago at 19, she was in a near fatal motorcycle accident and uh, has suffered a uh, traumatic brain injury with quadriparesis um, paralysis on the right side dominantly. I am her primary caregiver and we have personal care assistants that come in during the day for 12 hours. She communicates mostly with her body language. We were qualified to make it into the brain injury um, rehabilitation unit at Turo um, Hospital in New Orleans. Um, and that was about two weeks prior to um, Katrina, Hurricane Katrina um, making landfall. PJ still had a trach in her throat. PJ was not at the point where I could just scoop her up and put her in my car and take her home and then evacuate from there. I can remember vividly pulling PJ's hospital bed into the doorway and reading Psalms um, out of the Bible throughout the um, hurricane. The nurse did say that a plan had been put in place for evacuation and I asked to see it and was never shown that plan. Wednesday, no helicopters came to us. We saw them circling the city. Thursday, they started landing and pulling people out. Friday is when PJ was finally in line to go. As she was being moved up the transport line, the nurses restrained me and held me back. The nurse did say that the manila envelope that they had put on her chest would take care of everything. It was, just had her face sheet on it um, and did not describe her needs. And I lost control, um, started crying and yelling. And now the hand of the, the helicopter, out of the, ha the hand of the pilot came and motioned me to come aboard. Caregivers must be able to be evacuated with their patients, with their, you know, children. Um, it's absolutely a must. PJ would not have survived Hurricane Katrina if it wasn't for that hand that came out and said, come on. I'm, I'm very, very sure of that. The Right to be Rescued. Click here to watch the whole film now.